Okay. Today we're going to show you how do we do chakram. يعني كيف نعمل فحم. الخطوة الأولى. First step, we prepare these chunks of wood. So this is a big piece of wood here. The chance is it's not gonna burn out all all day, all night, but it's gonna convert to a piece of, of fire. Same thing with this chunk and same thing with this chunk here. Those are big ones. So they are not going to burn. They're not gonna burn. They will just be like a piece of, uh, go back a little bit. So they're just going to be not, not, not flame fire, but it's gonna be fire without flame. So then at night, when this is done, we dug this hole here, show them the hole. Okay, we have, um, we use this, and we use this pick. So tonight, inshallah, we're going to take those big pieces of uh, chunks of unflamed, hot, red type of fire. We're gonna place it in the hole we dug already prepared it okay and uh, this is how we do it now this hole not too far above too close I think. okay now now Tonight, after the show is over, we'll bring those chunks and put them in here. And we have to cover them with, with dirt. Once you cover them with dirt, they turn off and they will be very hot under the ground and they will convert into charcoal. They will turn off and convert into charcoal. This charcoal will put it on the side and for barbecue usage or for uh, future usage because uh, the advantage of this charcoal it's not going to make a smoke. It just will turn again to fire with no flame, but no smoke. And that's the best type, that's what's called charcoal. And that's uh, it's good for barbecue. Or if you want to put uh, some fire inside the house, you could do that. You could use this, uh, this type of charcoal because it doesn't make no smoke. So let's wait for tomorrow, for tonight. We will show you how we start the flame. And then at night we'll show you how to bury those big chunks in there. And then tomorrow you will see we'll see us getting the charcoal out from the ground. Yalla salam. Now we are on the second stage of the process. We're gonna burn this wood, and when it is totally burned, we're gonna place the big chunks in the hole and um, cover it with the with the dirt. And hopefully by tomorrow it will be converted to uh, charcoal. So let's start the second phase by burning the wood. There we go. Okay. Now I think we're in business. Slowly but surely.
Now we can stop it and wait to the end of the of this stage when we are ready to place the piece of chunks to the to the ground. Okay, we can stop now. Okay, here's the fire. It's uh, it's almost done. Now those pieces are ready to be converted to charcoal. They're big, but if you leave them. Uh, lightning if you leave the fire on eventually they will get burned out and they will uh, just disappear become ash however if you put them on the dirt and you and you cover them with the dirt then uh, they will survive and they will they will be so hot inside the ground where they will be converted to charcoal but they will not be burned and they will not be ash so now it's time to place them over there and start covering them up and i'm gonna cover them with this cardboard once i place this on top of them naturally it's gonna get burned if i don't do it quick so i have to put it in top and place the dirt on top of it it will stay as good as it can be so go back this way baba Back this way? No, go back this way because I'm going to oh. be using this. Now, here's the first one. Here's the big one. Here's the first one. Just place it here. Okay, so go ahead. And the second one. Here's the second one. Okay. Yeah, too close one. Okay. There's one. There's another one. Here's another one. See, I'm not uh, wearing heavy clothes because I'm playing with fire, but it's very cold in here. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so this, this is here. Now, look what I'm going to do. I'm going to place it and quick, I have to put the dirt on it, otherwise this will get burned. It's just here. Like that. And start burying. So long there is smoke coming out, that means it's not going to be converted to charcoal. The smoke has to stop, that means no air is reaching them anymore. So now, you see that? It's dead. That's it. Now the cardboard is not going to burn. It will not burn. Nothing will burn now. Now this will be... This is underground and you see not there is no smoke whatsoever if you put your hand here you don't feel anything you don't feel anything yeah so we have to wait until tomorrow tomorrow we will get the it's gonna be black charcoal big pieces will be good for barbecue and you can always convert them to back to 
fire like this but no no big flame or no smoke that's how they can be converted just like that yeah okay see you tomorrow okay now we have the charcoal right here under the ground so we need to dig it up and get it out this is what we left probably so there we go we're not gonna find no ash in here it's gonna be real real charcoal watch okay now do you remember what we covered the charcoal with this piece of board right here it did not burn you see that it didn't burn it just got a little bit burned but it did not burn because we had to cover it with the dirt so it wouldn't burn now here are the charcoals we placed the other day here's one this is just good to convert it to real flame with no smoke whatsoever here's another one it's another piece okay here's the another one it's a bigger one this is this is just better charcoal than the one you buy from home depot and here's the bigger the biggest one is right here see that now this is ready to go it will not have a flame but it will just light and glow a small one i think that's it so this is how you make see a small piece of charcoal right here this is better than the one we have in home depot it will just light back we have some here are here those are real charcoal you see that this is even better than the one we buy from home depot except this way is a lot cheaper so that's how you make charcoal i hope this will help whoever is interested to learn how to make charcoal without have to go to home depot and purchase it from there assalamu